Now I'm going to show you push-ups exercise, some variation. So if you don't have barbell and dumbbell, how do you work in your upper chest and lower chest? So basically, pectoralis is origin you is your sternum right here, and then your clavicle, and insertion is your humerus right here. So right this much is pectoralis. So when you do this kind of arm movement, such as inclined dumbbell press, working your upper portion of your pectoralis. When you do adduction movement, working your middle part of your pectoralis. And when you do this kind of movement, adduction movement, and then working your lower part over your chest like decline chest press and dips so let's do some variation of push-ups okay so regular push-up so position right here like this this is shoulder upper and this is 1.5 wide shoulder upper okay and then make sure your lower back straight inhale down for a second all the way and exhale up and inhale down and exhale so let's look at the side of you here so make sure lower back straight line so your whole body is down so not to do burps like that to working overactive your deltoid underactive your pectoralis also try not to do this one because this is really hard for the lower back also decrease your range of motion. So now, how do you work in your upper chest with a barbell and dumbbell? So let's make incline motion. How? Fit on the bench. Okay, make sure right here and like this. Okay, back nice and straight. Not like this. Right here. Inhale all the way down and exhale. Inhale and exhale. I can really feel my upper chest, even anterior deltoid, and tricep. So, this is your modified incline dumbbell chest press or barbell chest press. Now, how do you work in your lower part of your pectoralis? Okay, then your hands on your bench, right here. Inhale, then exhale. Inhale, then exhale. So this, only one bench, you can work in upper chest and middle and lower chest. Same time working your shoulder and triceps as well. If you want to do exercise, you can do a lot of exercise only with the bench.